Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Pisces. This is going to be for your September 2024. You can apply this to any of your placements. We are going to take a look and see uh, what you guys need to know for um, uh, September. Uh, and then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective uh, Pisces people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations, and your energies, I suggest you to book a personal reading with me. The link to that is in the description box below. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So, Pisces. What messages do we have for, for Pisces? What does Pisces need to know for September 2024 for Pisces? For Pisces. We have the Four of Swords. And also the world. Okay. Some of you guys could be disconnecting from the world here. Okay, let's say if you guys, you know, have a tendency to check social media a lot, you guys have a tendency to watch the news a lot. I feel like there's an energy of you guys unplugging here or that you guys are needing to unplug. Take some time out for yourself, connect with yourself, meditate here, be with yourself here and be present with yourself here, Pisces. All right, let's see what else we have. We have the Ten of Swords and also the Three of Swords here, wow. Seems like you guys are going through something here. Some sort of heartbreak here. Some sort of betrayal here. Something ended here very unexpectedly here. And I feel like you're trying to move on from it. I, another thing I'm feeling like when you guys, you know, watch social media or watch the news, some of you guys have a tendency to take on the sufferings of the world. It deeply affects your mood. And I feel like it's important for you guys, like I said, to unplug here. Okay? We have the Nine of Wands. You guys are absorbing energies left and right like a sponge here, Pisces. I'm not surprised. You know, you guys are quite psychic, quite empathic here, you know? So let's see what else we have for, Pi for Pisces. In the Five of Pentacles, yeah. You guys are taking on a lot at this time here. And like I said, it's important for you guys to unplug from your phones, from social media, from the news. Tell me the Four of Swords here with the Six of Cups, the World, and also the Four of Cups here. Another thing I'm getting here is that with the Four of Cups and the Six of Cups here, yeah, someone that you dealt with for a very long time has betrayed you here, okay? Someone here has let you down and you feel like you're trying to move on from this here, okay? Could be this King of Wands here, Aries, Will Sagittarius energy that has lied to you, that was deceptive here towards you. Whoever this is, I feel like this person walked away from you to be with somebody else here. So with the King of Wands, Aries, Will Sag, the Seven of Swords, the Eight of Cups. Let's get one more here. And the Four of Wands here, wow. Seems like, yeah, it seems like someone here walked away from a romantic relationship here. Seems like someone here walked over to the other side of the grass here, basically. Okay? You know, to be, to be quite honest here, I see this person regretting it. You know, I see this person eventually coming back around. What else do we have for, for Pisces? What else do we have for, for, for Pisces? What else does Pisces need to know what I got for work on? For September 2024 for Pisces. We have the Death card and the Three of Cups. The Death card and the Three of Cups. Knight of Cups and the Six of Swords. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. And also the King of Pentacles here and the King of Cups. 
King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, and the King of Cups here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. So Pisces, most of the King of Swords, we have all four kings that are out on the table here. Let's say if this masculine here betrayed you, lied to you here, they're trying to get back together here with you. So a couple of things happening here, there's definitely some sort of romantic relationship that you're dealing with here, somebody here that has lied to you here. And another thing that I'm getting here is that you guys are too invested on your in your phones, where you guys are watching a lot of stuff on social media and also the news where you guys are absorbing all the world's suffering here, okay? And they feel like you guys need to protect yourself and unplug, okay? We have the Ten of Cups here and the Three of Cups. We have the Knight of Cups and the Ace of Cups, okay? There's definitely some sort of unexpected betrayal here, and I feel like you're trying to basically move on from this, and you feel like this person's coming back around, trying to reconnect with you here, trying to work things out here with you with the Eight of Pentacles, okay? Some of the Six of Swords. Why is the Six of Swords here? In the Moon. Cancer, Pisces, Energy. Wow. You know, whoever this person is, this person has a lot of secrets here. I mean, perhaps the secret that this person might be holding on to or might have been keeping from you where you feel betrayed here is that this person's interested in the same sex here. King of Pentacles in the Hierophant here, Taurus energy. And also the King of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. You know, whoever this is, you know, there is some, some sort of unexpected betrayal here, but I, I feel like this person is loyal and committed into fixing things here with you. That's if you allow it. That's if you're okay with, you know, accepting this person back into your life here. But whatever has happened here, this really stung. And I feel like you're trying to take time away and try, trying to figure things out when it comes to this person here. What else do we have here for? Pisces, Ace of Swords, okay? Any sort of clarity that you're looking for here, I do believe that this person will provide that for you. We have the double card. Wow. Maybe this was meant to happen because I feel like the situation that you were in with this individual here could have been very, very, very toxic here. And this is perhaps it had to happen this way so that it was your way out. You know, it was your, your way of getting out here. Does that make sense? Five of Swords here. Yeah, there was just a lot of mind games in this situation here. There was a lot of mind games. There was a lot of lies here. Like, I feel like it had to happen this way in order for you to get out. Yeah. But, you know, I do see that, you know, this person will try and hoover you. This person will try and linger around. You know, this person will try and get back. They will try to find a way to get back into your life here. Let's see what else we have. Eight of Pentacles, okay. Yeah, they're gonna try and put an, a, a, an absorbent amount of effort to try and get you back. And I feel like you're basically turning your back on the situation here. Okay, look at all these queens here. Yeah, yeah, I just feel like you're, you don't wanna, you don't need to deal with the drama. You don't want the drama and I feel like you're distancing yourself from this individual. Yeah, with the Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups here, and the Emperor here. <sighs> Seems like you're dealing with a karmic situation here. Yeah. But yeah, I, I do feel like it had to happen this way so that it was your way out. Yeah, because I feel like it was an unhealthy situation that you were in with this individual. So Pisces, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.